in most of our videos we have performed a skin retouch for female uh, images but in this video we are going to perform skin retouch for male image it will be amazing super fun and super fast and we are going to do with uh, some amazing technique which is very very easy so don't go away stay tuned and uh, let's start our work Welcome back everyone, my name is Adnan Chaudhary from Tasty Tutorials and today we are going to perform a retouch for male face. Yes, uh, now you can make your skin much cleaner and much faster but let me show you what is before and after. So we are going to transform our image face from this to this. That's amazing and super fast. So let's start our work first of all we will close everything and uh, yes now we will start from very basic as you know so we'll go to our extension which is pixels as I already uploaded a video about it so in extension uh, we will search out for our stock which we need so we will need portrait so we'll search out for portrait and we have this image which I have already collected and it is going to download into our Photoshop once it's uh, downloaded into uh, our Photoshop you can see uh, the next step is we want to merge this so we could have the only area which we need so I think it's uh, enough for us so click on this check mark and now we are going to go to image uh, layer new layer and then background from layer that's nice now the first step is we'll where we will copy this layer you can see the face and uh, on the next step we are going to uh, invert this by pressing ctrl i from our keyboard it's inverted oh that's disaster don't be worried about that we will fix it soon now on the next step we will uh, change this blending mode to vivid light that's nice now on the next step we are going to do filter other and high pass and the high pass value should be 24.0 keep this value and hit ok now on the next step we will go to filter blur and Gaussian blur now it will maintain our uh, image detail let me just uh, show you with some zooming panel you can see that that's nice and I think we are fine with this or we can just move it to 3 or 4 I think we are fine with 1 I think yes that's uh, that's much better or we can go to 2 yes that's that's nice 2 is much better so we'll hit ok, okay. Uh, I would like to recommend you to live between uh, 2 and 4 so now we'll press alt and hold our alt key from our keyboard and click on this mask button that's nice now it will apply a inverted mask on our image and now we'll select our brush tool and make everything opacity and flow 100% then uh, we will uh, change this foreground color black to white size it up your size up your brush and now we will start painting only on the areas which we want to make softer don't apply this on eyes don't apply this on hairs just on the skin parts don't apply this on even the edges so we just want to apply this on uh, the face which is very very open like this and you can see it is doing very nicely so we will do it quickly here I would like to give you a tip that don't uh, use this brush on this under nose and on lips and on hairs or eyes just uh, paint this only on your face where you need this okay not necessary but where you really need this 
brush just brush it out so we'll do it quickly so as you can see that we have done it very nicely uh, here you can have a look and uh, it, it did very well job uh, let me show you from the zoom out style you can see that this is the before and after preview but we really need some detail extra detail on this image because we need some darker area some folded edges look like the faces uh, have some we can see that wrinkle on this side so how we can do that is we will create a new layer we'll press shift plus backspace or you can simply from go to edit and go to fill it will do the same job we will click on 50 percent gray and hit ok now we'll click on normal and click on soft light we have changed the blending mode from normal to soft light now we will simply just go to burn tool this will give us a detail so we'll keep this exposure to about uh, 25 percent keeping your uh, having your foreground color as black and now we will apply this on the darker side of our face like uh, this yes now what we'll do is we'll click on our dodge tool it will bright us the area which we want so we we'll bright the nose and a little bit of our face and then a little bit of our this cheek so that's it now the only thing left is our lip so what we'll do is we'll simply just go to our back uh, the we can see that uh, repair layer and select our mask and go to brush tool and we'll decrease the opacity and flow to 60 to 70 and we'll brush out on the lips and uh, for the upper lip we'll load on the opacity more and we'll do this on the lip that's great now we'll go to layer which is called uh, dodge and burn that's great and we'll select our burn tool or uh, yes dodge tool and we'll simply just increase the exposure to about 54 or 50 to 60 and we'll simply just do that great or you can just do a small thing on the lips there we go and we have done our work let me just show you the before and after preview look at this and uh, yeah there we go i hope you like this video if you like this video and found this video helpful make sure to give this video a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe we will meet in our next video never stop never depend and keep learning.